It is my great honor to welcome you to our college graduation ceremony. Everyone say overpriced education. Tell them about the big interview. Hopperman and Browning Publishing. Wow! It's a ride. I'm riding Malby. I have an interview at 10 o'clock. Have a seat with the rest of the applicants. Why do you want this job? I'm driven. Most importantly, I'm incredibly enthusiastic about the work your company is doing. Really? Like what? I totally freaked out. That is the girl that I fell in love with, but harbors platonic feelings for me, unfortunately. Uh, your feet are freezing. Feet are always freezing. I have the feet of an 80-year-old man. Ooh, that's hot. What are you doing? I got into law school. We'll see. Ryden, what about you? Just keeping my options open. So what you're saying is you're unemployed. I have no job, and I live with my parents. How'd it go? I asked the VP if she was pregnant. No. She was just fat. Oh. This is not the way it's supposed to go. You're not supposed to come back when you've already left the nest. No, I don't want your pity hug. Come on. Or no town screw up. Shit. <laughs> Maybe you're setting your sights too high. Where do you think I should be setting my sights? Eye contact. Remember? We talked about it. Are you staking out the place or what? <laughs> David. Right in. I'm across the street. You're welcome to come by if you get bored. Tomorrow night, me, you, that dress. We're gonna go out to a big fancy dinner. What you do with your life is just one half of the equation. More important is who you're with when you're doing it. Oh my god. I completely forgot. Our dinner. Let me explain. What exactly needs explanation? This song is for someone I care about a lot. Ryden Melby? Do you want to hang out later? I decided to go to Columbia. You're going to New York? This whole post-graduation thing is not turning out the way I planned. The world's a screwy place. It doesn't play by the rules. Do you think I'm making the right decision? Alexis Bledel. Post-grad.